Yo, what's up guys? Andy here with another episode of Tap Lab. Starting this one out on Instagram. And today I'm gonna to show you how to use the new Instagram sliding polls feature. Before we get into it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a like on this video. I'd really appreciate it. It helps me out and it helps new people discover the channel. Now to use this feature, all you wanna do is snap a photo or a video using this button. So I'm gonna go ahead and take a photo. And then what we wanna do is hit the stickers icon in the top right corner, the smiley face with the folded corner. And then if we look towards the bottom right of the screen, there's a new feature. And if we tap on that, it's gonna allow us to do a slider poll. So we can type whatever we want here. So I typed, is this feature lit? And then you can drag this yourself and uh, it'll give you a preview of sort of what it looks like when other people are dragging it. And then you can select which emoji you want down here on the bottom. So I could use the fire emoji, the 100 emoji, or we can add any emoji that we want here. So that's a pretty cool addition. Let's pick a whale. But I'm just gonna go ahead and use the fire one for this. And in the top center of the screen, you can also tap that and get some different styles there. So if you want the purple box, you can do that. Or if you want the white box, you can do that. I'm just gonna keep it on the white. And then I'm gonna hit done. And then we can position this wherever we want on the screen. It's a little laggy in the way that they have it dragging now. So that might be something that they're working on fixing. But I'm just gonna put it right there in the center. We can also make it bigger or smaller. Let's make it a little bigger position it in the center, and then you can send that to your friends or story as you normally would. I'll just add this one to my story real quick. And then in the top left, I can tap on my story. It's gonna give a little bounce to notify people that this is a new feature. You can drag this thing and rate this however you would like. And then if I do this, we can select wherever we want. So about 50%, 100%, I'll go with 100%. A fire is gonna fly up to the top of the screen and then you're good to go. We can see what people have rated here. I'm the only one that's rated so far and it's at 100%. And I'm gonna to go to my profile, go to my archives. I actually did one of these polls recently so we can look at the answers for this. I'm gonna swipe up and 42 people answered and most people are saying it's pretty lit. Some people are saying it's not cool at all, which is understandable. But for the most part, people people like this feature. That might just be because it's new. It might be because it's an actual good feature. We don't know yet, it's pretty new. We'll see what comes of it and if Instagram decides to keep it around. But for now, that's how you use the new Instagram slider polls feature. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Be sure to drop a comment down below if you have any questions and I'll try and answer those. I'll also put a link to an Instagram playlist down in the description if you wanna check that out. There's tons of other tutorial videos for Instagram. And be sure to subscribe to the channel for daily videos on mobile apps, tech, social media, and all that good stuff. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you next time.